Now let's go for the official inauguration of the U.S. Government Exchange Alumni Association, Lagos Chapter. Here they are at this extraordinary event, a handful of alumni of various U.S. exchange programs. Over the years, the United States government has provided opportunity for Nigerian professionals, civil and social activists, academics and journalists to travel to the country to participate in exchange programs where they acquire knowledge and hone skills applicable to impacting their fields of endeavor. There are more than 10 U.S. exchange programs in Nigeria, from which more than 4,000 people have benefited. While many of the programs run concurrently, it's easy to keep track of people's progress and the impact of the program. Therefore, creating the U.S. Government Exchange Alumni Association, Lagos Chapter, is a great environment for alumni of different associations to cross-fertilize ideas and build a stronger society. Indeed, working together has several benefits and implications. It will enable us to interact better, will enable us to relate better, and to achieve intergroup collaboration and to more effectively implement social programs. Not given to long speeches, the U.S. Ambassador to Nigeria, Stuart Simington, summarizes why it is so important to have an association like this. That bridge, like leadership, has got to go both ways. That bridge, like governance, has got to go both ways. There is no such thing as good governance if the people who are being governed are not good citizens. And this speech gave way for the official launch of the Alumni Association. One, two, three. Over the years, many alumni have distinguished themselves in their various professions, and the association at the maiden event decided to recognize them. Some of those honored this day are the Governor of Lagos State, Mr. Akiomi Ambodi, the Chairman, Channels Media Group, Mr. John Momo, who is represented by Channels Television's news anchor, Amara Chubani, veteran broadcaster, Mr. Sonny Rabo, and Professor Chioma Agomo, among others. of my country and I know that Nigeria has such great people. I call Nigeria the most endowed nation on earth. Human resources, natural resources, whatever, we have it. And therefore there's no reason why we should be a bigger nation. And so a program like this is an opportunity for us to take our rightful place. I'm excited. Quite a valuable experience if you're trained by the U.S. government to do some of the things we were made to do here. You might call them the privileged few, but members say the exchange programs have changed their views on the world, expanded their sphere of influence, and reignited a fire that was already burning low. A platform has been created to, among other things, help members exchange ideas, network, and build a stronger society and they hope to take advantage of it, impacting the lives of Nigerians. Yes, this is where we draw the cuttings yeah. on the program today. I hope you we had have fun. had an amazing time, mm -hmm. and I hope you did. Yeah. If you did, just go to Channels TV via YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash channels web. Click on the playlist, and of course, you find Metrofile there. Watch as many editions as you can. All right. We'll see you again very soon. Our Twitter handles are right on your screen, and there's a number blinking there. You can call to find out details about the program. I'm Anne Mwawadu. And I'm Ogich Kwasi. Also remember that this edition of Metrify repeats on Saturday at 12 noon and a fresh edition comes up on Sunday 9.30 a.m. with a repeat broadcast on Wednesday 11 p.m. Please do watch out for it. Thank you so much for watching. We shall we see you again next week. God bless. <music>